it's time to change out the radiator fluid on this motorcycle first thing you want to do is make sure that engine's cold the coolant is cold and it's not pressurized disconnecting any of the components why it's pressurized and hot could cause bodily injury and property damage or you get a wrench remove the four screws that hold the radiator cover on. take that cover off inspect it for any damage and repairs necessary and you got to remove that radiator cap do it slowly till it gets to the first click so if there is any pressure in it it will release and then you can take it off the rest of the way inspect that cap for any corrosion or con contamination okay now you're gonna look for the drain on the radiator there is no drain on this radiator so I can see it's plumbed into the motorcycle frame I follow that framing I can see where it's plumbed back into the engine and right there is a drain plug so I'm gonna go ahead and remove this drain plug remember when you're draining antifreeze it's hazardous it's poisonous to animals make sure you contain all that fluid and get it to your recycling agent okay once you have it all drained go ahead and put your drain plug back in secure it and you want to fill your system up with your new antifreeze make sure you read the label sometimes you have to add water sometimes you don't fill it all the way up you probably have some air bubbles on there so you want to run that motor watch that fluid circulate in the radiator once it's circulating, that means your thermostat is open. And what's happening is you're removing the air bubbles. And you might have to do this a couple of times. And then you got to refill it, run the motor. If you have to refill it, you still got air bubbles. Run the motor until you don't have to refill it anymore. Then you can replace your radiator cap. Go ahead and run it again. Let it get warm. Let it pressurize and then inspect for leaks once you're satisfied all the air bubbles are out and you have no leaks go ahead and put your radiator cover back on and that's all there is to it make sure you watch all your warnings only work on it when it's cold hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching